Hey guys, it's Jay Kapoor here and in this video I will show you how to install Android M preview on your computer. Yes, we will do this by using Android SDK and creating a AVD. So let's start. First of all, we have to download the SDK tools. To do this, click on the first link in the description that will take you to this page. Now click on standalone. SDK tools now click on download SDK tools now in the meantime we have to download one more file so click on the second link in the description that will take you to this page Java JDK we have to check one thing that if you are running on 32 bit based system or 64 bit to do this just right click on your my computer or this pc go to the properties and see if it's 32 bit or 64 bit then download according to this if it's 32 bit click on windows x86 if it's uh, 64 bit then click on windows x64 so once both the files are downloaded we have to install java jdk first it's pretty easy to install just click on the java jdk setup file and click on next 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 and it will be installed after the java jdk is installed we have to install android sdk manager just click on the exe file and follow the on screen instructions After the SDK tools are installed, click on finish and it will launch the SDK manager. Click on deselect all. Now just select three things. Just click on SDK platform for Android M. Now we have to check one more thing. Just go to the system properties and see if you are running a AMD processor or an Intel processor. If you are running a AMD processor like me, then you have to download ARM64 image or ARM EABI V7A system image. Or if you are running a Intel processor, then you can download from Intel x86 Atom64 image or Intel x86 Atom system image. You have to download one file from the two options available. Just one more thing, if you are running an Intel processor, then scroll down, you will see extras and in that folder, you will see Intel x86 emulator accelerator. So you have to select this package also. This will improve the AVD performance. So once three, uh, two or three packages are selected, click on install packages. Now accept the terms and click on install. It will take some time to download and install. Once everything is installed, see on the top left you will see a tools option. Click on that and click on manage AVDs which means Android virtual device. Now click on create a new AVD. Name it anything. I will name it M. Now select a device. You can select any device but I will select Nexus 5. Now click on target and select Android M preview and that's it and select a skin you can select no skin and for RAM always uh, select half a amount of RAM like if your if your PC has 4 GB of RAM then sell uh, then enter 2 GB RAM here uh, 1 GB RAM is equal to 1024 MB so 2 GB RAM will be 2048 MB and for internal storage I will recommend at least 1 GB so write 1024 and for SD card also I will recommend at least 1 GB now just uh, fill these details and click on use host GPU this will improve the ABD performance if you have a graphic card so just click on OK it will stuck for like 5 to 10 seconds don't worry it is creating a avd now you will see result of creating avd just click on ok now select the avd and click on start now click on launch and it will say starting emulator for avd m so that's it android m is launching now 
it may take 5 to 10 minutes or sometimes 15 minutes to set up the first boot of AVD. I know guys that the performance is sluggish and there is no use of it unless you are a developer. But if you want to see the new features of Android M and don't have an access device you can try this. This was just a proof of concept video that yes you can run the latest version of Android in your PC. That's it for this video guys click the red subscribe button to see more of these videos. Comment down below if you have any better option to run Android M in PC.